Hey, what's going on? This is Marcus Nades with Team BD Reason, and I'm so excited for today's video because I'm going to be teaching you a concept I learned from one of my mentors, Steve Larson and Russell Brunson, actually. These two guys, you know, it's really how to create general racial wealth with your MLM and your network marketing company. Like, how do you actually do that? This is something that I'm striving to do in my business so I can, you know, leave a legacy for my kids and, you know, give them something to be proud of that, you know, I actually built and then, you know, leave them something as I move toward the afterlife, you know, and we all think about it and we all want to really accomplish that. But, you know, how do we really do that? And, you know, I'm going to take you inside of my computer today and take you inside of my course so you can hear, you know, the the exact way and the exact strategy that those two guys talk about of, you know, how you really develop that and build your business online and, and start to really build that foundation and build the legacy so you can constantly get new customers coming into your business, seeing your business opportunity every single day and you getting new leads and building a true asset because that's what it's all about for us. We want to build a true asset and a business. So, you know, I'm going to take you over to my computer in a second. And if you stick with me into the end of this video, I'm actually going to give you a special gift and it is actually going to be free. So uh, make sure you stick with me to the end. I'm going to take you inside of our course um, that we have where we're actually showing you exactly those steps you need in order to start building your asset online, building your list, um, getting pre-qualified good leads into your network marketing business, um, and just making sure that you have the right system and knowing, you know, what you need to do in order to create that general racial wealth that you are about to learn about. Okay. So if you like that, make sure you hit the subscribe button, make sure you hit the like button, uh, below this video and also comment in the comment section um, for some more videos or some other videos you'd like for me to drop. Okay. So with that being said, let's jump into the presentation. If you're looking at the screen, it says the get money formula. What you're going to learn inside of this module is the number one formula you need to create generational wealth and live the lifestyle of your dreams. Now, as always, I want to just tell you guys a quick story. If you don't already know this story about me, um, back in 2016, I was going through it. Uh, my father passed away. Um, so it, a big part of my life disappeared. Uh, he passed away in January and, and in March, I went out to Las Vegas um, doing the March Madness, first week of March Madness. Great time to be out in Vegas. If you haven't done it, make sure you go out there and do that. But first weekend in March Madness and out there with some friends and just got done eating some Panda Express on my way to meet my friends so we can go to a pool party. And as I walk in the door, all of a sudden I see, you know, one of the most beautiful women in my life just cross my eyes and we kind of stared each other down and I kind of kept walking by because she was talking to another guy or whatnot. But, you know, as soon as he left, you know, I, I took my shot. So I went up to her, asked her her name, you know, she told me her name was Kim and where she was from. And we turns out we both were from Michigan. She actually lived two hours away from where I was living. Um, and, you know, from day one, we connected uh, and, you know, we've been together ever since. So after we lost, left Las Vegas, so what happens in Vegas actually came back to Michigan. Uh, we started to really build our life together. You know, a couple months after we got back from Vegas, she found out she was pregnant and that we were going to have a kid together. She already had two kids prior. I already had two kids prior. And now we're going to have one together. As you see in this picture, this is our blended family. So about from March 2016 up until, 
you know, February when my son Grayson was born, everything was great. We were planning our lives, planning our future, you know, really and every all the kids were getting along, everything you wanted as, you know, as you transition into, you know, unusual times, specs especially under unusual circumstances of how we met. So the transition was actually great. And, you know, two weeks after my son Grayson was born, you know, I returned back to work because they gave me some time off, time off so I can, you know, spend time with Kim and the baby. And two weeks after I returned, I got fired from my job. So all of a sudden, you know, I had no money. I had a house two hours away from me or back in Grand Blank where I was living with my other kids. So, you know, I can no longer afford to live in that house. I was also two hours away from my other two kids. I had a new baby and all of a sudden my girlfriend at the time, she's paying all the bills. And, you know, that was real tough for me. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking I'm recovering from the loss of my dad and I got a new girl and everything is peaking and all of a sudden, bam, at the bottom. And during that time, I felt so like betrayed. I felt a lot of emotions because, you know, I had been bouncing from, you know, job to job ever since I graduated with a master's degree in college. You know, I, I felt like, you know, I should have a job. I was living the American dream. You know, I went to college. I got a bachelor's degree. I went to college. I got a master's degree. And now all of a sudden I'm overqualified or, you know, working jobs that, you know, really didn't fit what I wanted to do anyways. I mean, I got degrees in sports management, you know, so I'm being, I'm a carpenter jobs and doing a lot of jobs that I didn't, really want to do. So I was frustrated. I was done working for other people. I was tired of it because I was, I felt I was being used. And, you know, that day when I got fired, I remember coming home pissed off and, you know, Kim, she told me that everything is going to be all right. You know, find something that I'm passionate about. I need to find something that I love and what I want to do. And, you know, I, I, at the time, I didn't know what that was. OK, and then, you know, a couple of weeks later, I got a, a phone call from one of my friends. And then here I am. I found MLM again. He uh, got me on the phone. He was talking about a, a company and he had his, you know, upline leader on the other line. You know, the typical MLM call, the three way phone call. He clicked over. You know, the guy was telling me about the, the product and, you know, the owners and how, you know, we can build the business because he was a million dollar owner in their previous network marketing company. And, you know, he was just talking the good talk like all upline leaders do. And then they're supposed to because, you know, we all are excited about MLM. So we want everybody to know the benefit and the asset that MLM can bring to someone's lives and that's what he was doing so you know um i flew down they were having a, a pre-launch event in orlando um i didn't have any money at the time you know so um the guy ended up paying for me to get down there we me and my friends right here in this picture this is my boy turner and tercy these guys we all went down to this event and you know we were in the room with a lot of people and they were having a great time having fun and yelling and you know so i end up joining the mlm after i came home so i made a list of family and friends turner tercy and i we were all calling the same people i mean we grew up together so the the same people are getting phone calls from me like they're getting phone calls from turner and like the message is getting old you know, so I'm trying to invite people on three way calls and eventually, you know, after a month or two, my business basically died again because I ran out of leads. I didn't have anybody else to talk to. So I quit. All right. But after I quit, I started to think to myself, like I just knew MLM and network marketing could be such a great asset. And I, I just wondered, like, how are the top producers and how are the people who are 
you know, making all the money, like what are they doing in order to consistently make that amount of money and build their empire and build their business? Like, what are they doing? So I spent the next two years basically raising my son, staying at home, you know, and during this time, I just studied how to be an entrepreneur and how to be, you know, how to learn marketing and network marketing. And I spent two years just studying the top producers in MLM and in funnels and, and things like that, just learning a lot from them and understanding how to get leads and what they were doing. And, you know, during this this time of just growth, basically for me, I found this formula. So this formula, if you get this, make sure you take notes. If you get this one thing from this formula, you will absolutely just crush it in this industry. Okay. So you have to really think like an investor. Okay. I'm going to walk through some investment vehicles where you can actually make some money that and you're going to basically see once i break it down to you the benefits of being here today and you are going to be totally blown away after i go through this okay so let's walk through the get money formula right now okay so let's say you were going to spend 165 dollars a month just on anything and you were going to put it away for you're just going to put it in your mattress okay for 25 years if you were to do this every month for 25 years you would get forty nine thousand dollars after 25 years with no interest okay because you can't collect interest because it's under the mattress all right <laughs> so say let's say all right what other vehicles can I make, say, 3% on? So something like a savings account. All right. You put $165 a month away at 3%, 25 years. The total amount is somewhere roughly about $73,000 after 25 years if you put your money in a savings account. Okay. So what else can we put our money in that's going to get something say like six percent all right so a cd all right we put 165 dollars a month in a cd for at six percent at 25 years you're roughly going to make one hundred fourteen thousand dollars. okay so i'm not very good at math so a lot of these are, are rough you know, I just round it up or round it down. <laughs> so, you know, this is what you would, you know, make if you were to put your money in a CD. All right. So now you say, come to me and say, you know, Marcus, I want to make 7% on my, you know, on my money. I want to invest. All right. So $165 at 7%, you put it in a 401k. For 25 years, you're going to make roughly about $134,000. All right, that's at 7%. So now you're like, all right, I'm going to start a food franchise. And I know that, you know, most food franchises on the, you know, upper end, you know, make 16%. Okay. So, you put your money in a food franchise, $165 a month at 16%. For 25 years, you're going to make roughly $654,000 with the food franchise. Okay. Now, check this out. Say you want to make 20% yield on $165 a month. All right. $165 a month, 20%. You do this for 25 years, you put it into Zervita, because Zervita basically pays us 20% to push their products out to 
promote their products. Okay. So Servita is going to pay us 20%. So the next thing you need to understand is this. All right. This is the number one concept you need to understand. Whoever can spend the most money to acquire a customer wins. Okay, so I want you guys to recognize what a win is. If you were to go to an ATM, all right, and for every dollar you put into an ATM, they gave you a dollar twenty back, would you be happy? Ask yourself this question. I mean, I would. That's a twenty percent profit. Like, if I could put a dollar in and get a dollar twenty back, like hell yeah i like that you know what i'm saying so what if you were to put thirty dollars into facebook ads per day okay and you had 100 visitors come to your website all right 10 people saw your self-liquidating offer out of the 100 so that means 10 percent of those people opted in you had 100 visitors per day come there so day one, 100 people came, 10 people see your SLO. So that means 10 people opted in. All right. So that's 10% opt-in rate. All right. And say out of those 10 people, one person bought your self-liquidating offer. Say it was $37. So one sale per day for 30 days equals $210 profit. Okay. So just think if you invested $30 a day into Facebook ads, okay, 100 visitors per day saw your offer, okay, out of those 100, 10 people opted in and then they saw your self liquidating offer on the next page, on the second page. And then just one of those people bought the $37, okay? you already have paid for your ad cost with one buyer because you made a seven dollar profit all right and these numbers are low okay so what if three people bought this 37 dollar product you know everything else after this is pure profit all right that's what the big mlm top producers that's what they aren't telling you okay it's a numbers game all we have to do is flood traffic facebook ads youtube ads youtube videos organic traffic to our one offer and get people to the second page so we can use this money and reinvest back into our ads which is why we're calling it a self-liquidating offer so now you're going to be asking yourself, how can I invest more? Look, how can I invest more? If you spent $30 a day and you were getting $37 back a day, you will be asking yourself, how can I invest more? Because you're going to be making a $7 profit every single day. All right. This is the formula that the top producers are, are using and this is the formula that i'm going to be showing you guys and i'm going to be teaching you and you're if you don't know how to run facebook ads that's fine i'm going to teach you how to run facebook ads and how to set up the ads so that you are facebook compliant and also zervita compliant so and to make sure that we're just compliant all around all right i'll be showing you so do not do not worry about that i just wanted you guys to see the vision of where we're headed all right this is going to be big time this is going to make us unstoppable if we just do what the system allows us to do okay so it's all about the system what this training offers is a system to recruit people it's also a system to sell their zervita products and it's a system to train people all right we combine all of this because it's faster than three-way phone calls home parties and hotel meetings money moves faster than words 
okay? So just think about how you need to look at this and how you need to start looking at at it as like an investor, like I mentioned a couple slides earlier, be an investor, invest in your business and be willing to go out and find the, your dream customers, okay? That's what we're all about and team be the reason. That's what we want to showcase you guys. And, you know, money disclaimer, there's no amount of money that you can't make with this if you're, you know, positioning yourself as an authority and you're putting content out there and you're adding value to the marketplace, okay? The sky is the limit, all right? And I wanna be able to challenge you guys and compete with you guys for the top producers in Zervita. I wanna thank you for taking time out to watch this video. Because you stuck with me to the end, I wanna offer you a free MLM training course. My five-step system to help you auto-recruit your downline of big producers so you can recruit more people and sell more products in your MLM, okay? Just click the link inside of the description of this video. It'll take you over to a page where you can actually create a login and log in right into the five-step system and you can start taking the classes right away, all right? So I hope this video brought you a lot of value. And remember, it's time to be the reason for your own success. Take care.